General uh, Joshua Ansa, uh, he's uh, Deputy Secretary General of the Trade Union Congress. He's actually joined me on the line now. Uh, let me engage him further on this particular subject. Uh, Mr. Ansa, you're welcome to CTI Witness News. Uh, what is your understanding of the Finance Ministry's offer um, for an exchange of, um, of, of funds uh, the, the, under the Domestic Debt Exchange Program? What's your understanding of what it will encompass? If you ask about my understanding of the, the program itself, yes, what I know, whether, whether it is how it is going to affect workers, that's what I meant. Oh, okay, okay. Really, I must be frank with you that uh, we just received uh, a, a copy of the memorandum of understanding that is in the new exchange uh, data, and what we have going to do is that Organized Labor is organizing a meeting uh, two days from now to look at the new SM memorandum, what it entails and what it speaks to. Then we can discuss and the Organized Labor will make a decision on that. Now, prior to the announcement yesterday, were you guys informed or engaged in any way by the ministry? Uh, to, to be frank with you, on the 1st of June, there were some delegations from the Ministry of Finance who met with us and uh, they presented the PDA presentation. To be frank with you, me, I was not convinced or I did not understand the result of the presentation. So what we demanded was that we were demanding the exchange memorandum paper. That will be the details of whatever presentation that they did so that we could also study and come out with a position on whatever the, the new uh, or the alternative uh, paper ought to seek. Are you willing, though, uh, for your pension funds to be subjected to the DDEP? My brother, as I said, I already told you that uh, as for us, I speak now, our position has not changed. Our position on the DDEP, the noble area for our pension funds to be used for that program has not changed. Not until we, we, we study the new alternative memorandum, we look at what it entails, and if it is very positive, maybe the TEC of government government must look at it and make a decision. So until, until we look at it and make a decision, I cannot say much about it. Our old position is still the same. Very well. Thank you so much. That's Joshua Ansan. He's Deputy Secretary General of the Trade Union Congress, TUC.